Tony Klinger and I made films and have been doing so. It's 51 years. I started off as a projectionist, assistant projectionist, I listen to it. Um, an assistant editor, a unit manager, a camera assistant, did all, all the technical grades, um, which was very useful later. And I then went on to become a producer, director, writer, and now presenter. Um, and so I've been every technical grade. I haven't done the, I've never been a plaster or anything like that, but I've done all the technical grades, which is very useful for anybody that's starting out to know how those things work, even if you're not going to be a cameraman or a sound person, because you know what they should be doing. Uh, and it saves lots of problems if you know technically what you're doing. You need to ally yourself with people that you can trust and you want to work with. You can't do it by yourself. That, that, the writing bit I like because I can do it by myself, but the filmmaking bit, you need a team. And so if I wanted to say anything to people in Northampton, is get yourself into a team. Uh, find producers, find directors. You can't do it with yourself, it's not possible. It's, it's a page one mistake. So the first thing to do is to say, what's your core team? The core team is the writer, the producer, the director. The, the golden triangle. If you can have that, and you, and you have to look after each other, because there'll be times where one of you is more successful than the other one, so you have to pull them along. Uh, and there comes a time, sometimes you fall out, but you have to say, what's the long-term goal that we agree about? What are the things we agree about? And it's like a football team or something like that. If you've got two centre-backs, you can't have a gap. You can't have one of them's going to run and the other one's not going to run. You've both got to run. And you've both got to really work hard. But there is nothing stopping anybody from Northampton or Timbuktu from doing anything. There's no difference about race, religion, creed, age, nothing. doesn't matter. Talent and hard work. No one's going to give you a gig because you come from North Africa. No one's not going to give you a gig because you come from North Africa. They're going to give it to you because you, you're good, you're competent, you do what you say you're going to do, you're trustworthy, and you deliver on time. Um, <laughs> is it need, 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 needed to say, and the stuff's good? Uh, you know, the, you can't get away with anything like that. I was saying earlier here that the opportunities now in the country, not just North Africa, but in England, are unbelievable. I, I was calculating just one area of, near London. There's 4,800 new jobs coming on stream in the next two years. Um, and there are <laughs> those kind of opportunities. Shepparton's built another, another million square foot of, of studio space. Pinewoods bought the stuff over the road, so they're going to double. It's going on and on. This is the, well, not far off being as big as Los Angeles as a production center. It's the second biggest in the world. If people you know, want to get into this industry, now's the time. If you're not passionate about this, don't do it. There are easier ways to make a living. Um, you know, be a lawyer, do land deals, be a property developer. Uh, so, and, and I don't decry it because everybody's got a right to do what they want to do. But if you want to be in the film industry, you really have to work very hard. But you have to also have that belief, the self-belief that, yeah, I can do this. I've never said I couldn't do anything to anybody ever. Sometimes you, and you can't, <laughs> sometimes you say, I'll, I'll find a way, I'll learn. Uh, and there's no limitation. The limitation is usually self-imposed.